Elite Facts presents Crazy Babysitter Stories Babysitting isn't nearly as easy as it looks. Sure, you hear the odd stories about kids being as good as gold and their babysitters being nice and kind, but you also hear things from the other side of the spectrum where kids are a nightmare to look after or the babysitters are weird or just hopeless at their jobs. Well, we're going to concentrate on those stories. Here are 10 of the craziest babysitter stories we've ever heard. But before we begin, we should mention that we've omitted the names of those involved and for obvious reasons. Okay, here we go. 6. The Reorganizer Sometimes change can be nice, but you know what's not nice? When someone is making changes without asking you first. And that's exactly what this one babysitter did when these parents hired their friend's daughter to look after their kids for the first time. When the parents arrived back home after their night out, they found a very, very creepy surprise. The babysitter had reorganized almost everything in the house. We're not talking about moving a few items around on shelves or anything as simple as that. No, she moved everything. After she left, the parents spent quite a bit of time walking around finding more and more things she had been into. The kitchen was completely reordered, closets had different things in them, and all of their CDs, DVDs, etc. were all rearranged. And there wasn't a particular or obvious pattern to what she'd done either. There was no clear system that made sense, just random, unintuitive changes. It was super creepy. Naturally, the parents never called her back again. That must have been an awkward conversation with the babysitter's parents, their friends, later on down the line. 5. The Scarer as a babysitter, sometimes it can be fun to mess with the kids, you know, tell them a few spooky stories and whatnot. Well, this particular instance may have crossed the line. These parents left their kids, who at the time were only five and eight years old, with a babysitter. And according to the person who reported this story, they were both self-contained kids who were quietly playing with their toys and having a good time on their own. The babysitter was only really there to make sure that they didn't hurt themselves, you know, like a good babysitter would. But instead of just putting the kids to bed and watching TV the rest of the night, like most babysitters do, she wanted to be more involved. At about 9 p.m., she screamed for the two kids to come into the living room. She then told them that she saw a man outside wearing a mask and looking through the windows, and told them both to get down and be very quiet. After 10 minutes, they heard the handle of the door turning. The younger sister was silently sobbing in paralyzing fear. It turns out it was the parents coming through the door and not some stranger. Seeing their children scared out of their minds, they naturally asked what the heck was going on. And according to the source of this story, once the parents found out about the babysitter's sick little game, she was never hired again. Four. Waiter for the night. Now, it's not out of the ordinary for a babysitter to maybe have a drink or two, just as long as they don't go off the rails and they still have their wits about them to look after the kids. Well, according to the person relating this story, this babysitter got hammered on the job. The babysitter, a good friend of the family, was hired to look after their eight-year-old daughter. And she decided to make the little girl her personal bartender and waitress, as she had her mixing rum and cokes for her and bringing them to her all night long. Pretty much half coke and half rum. The babysitter noted that the drinks tasted funny because they were obviously a bit strong, but the little girl blamed it on the knockoff cola her mom bought. Luckily, nothing serious happened. The parents actually thought it was hilarious because their daughter used the opportunity to watch horror films she was otherwise not supposed to watch. I'm sure there are a lot of kids who would have done the exact same thing. 3. The Stranger in the Trench Coat being a babysitter young enough to need a babysitter yourself can be tricky. Not only are you responsible for looking after another young kid, but you also have to look after yourself. Now, imagine being a young babysitter and seeing a stranger pacing up and down your path, hoping that you'll open your door. You'd be absolutely terrified. In this story, a young boy was asked by his parents to look after his younger sibling while they went out. Later that night, after the parents left, the doorbell rang. Now, because he was taught about stranger danger and not to answer the door when home alone, the young babysitter just ignored it. Almost immediately after, the doorbell rang another five times in quick succession. Naturally, this got the babysitter's attention as he thought maybe it was a family member or some kind of an emergency. 
but just to be safe, he went into the dining room and peered through the window. He saw a man wearing a hat and a trench coat walking away from the house and then pacing up and down his driveway. Naturally, the young babysitter freaked out, but he still had the presence of mind to check and make sure that the back door was locked. He then directed his younger brother to go and make sure both the garage and front door were both locked. And just as the younger brother was at the front door checking the lock, the man began ringing the doorbell and knocking again, and even turning the doorknob right as the child was standing there. After a few minutes, the mysterious stranger gave up and left. As a kid, that must have been terrifying. 2. Underage Drinking this one is every parent's worst nightmare. A mother had to leave town on short notice due to a family emergency, so she called her regular babysitter and left her in charge of four kids. When the kid's grandmother stopped by later in the day to check on them, she was horrified to find her one-year-old grandson completely unresponsive. She rushed him to the hospital where it was discovered that he had an alcohol content level of .33. That's four times the legal limit. An empty bottle of wine that did not belong to the mother was found at the house. Luckily, the grandson made a full recovery. 1. The Babysitter Drank Way Too Much Here we have another story of a babysitter drinking more than she should have, and this babysitter went completely overboard. This babysitter was looking after a child that was only six years old when the kid's parents went out to a Christmas party. The babysitter, who was between 25 and 30 years old, decided to have a little Christmas cheer herself and helped herself to the liquor cabinet and drank until she passed out. The kid did the smart thing by staying up until her parents got back home. Turns out the babysitter needed to go to the hospital to get her stomach pumped. Merry Christmas! And that's our list. Did we leave any out? Let us know in the comments below and please remember to subscribe and tap that bell button to be notified when new videos are uploaded. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like us and subscribe for more elite facts.